You are looking at that harrowing footage we first showed you last week, an 84-year-old woman speeding the wrong way down an interstate near Philadelphia. She says she was on her way to the dentist when she caused all that havoc on the highway, driving for several miles on the wrong side of the median. Although no one was seriously injured, she caused four accidents. And as Jeremy Hubbard reports, she has also sparked a new debate on whether some seniors should be stopped from driving. She's barreling down the interstate as if nothing's wrong. An 84-year-old woman behind the wheel of this station wagon, oblivious to the oncoming traffic. It was traumatic, you know, it was just, it was, it was something I never, ever thought I'd see. Tim Fleming pulled out his cell phone camera to record the jaw-dropping sight on I-95 outside Philadelphia Thursday, desperately honking his horn, trying to get her attention. I saw a car swerving around there, and she wouldn't stop, and I yelled at her again, she just waved her arm at me, just like, leave me alone. Amazingly, no one was seriously hurt despite the four crashes she caused. Her road trip, a reminder of the dangers sometimes associated with older drivers. This is a critical issue now and will be even more so in 5, 10, 20 years. Statistics show drivers 65 and older are 16% more likely to cause an accident than younger drivers between ages 25 and 64. So what are the warning signs? Have there been recent crashes, recent tickets? Has there been a major change in seeing, thinking, or moving? All of those are red flags and should make the person seek a formal assessment of their driving skills. It can be physically harder to drive when you age. ABC's John Berman tested a suit designed by an insurance company to simulate the ailments of older drivers, including a neck brace that limits range of motion. He discovered even putting the car in reverse is tough. I can't. I can't see by me. Confusion is the problem for some older drivers. In 2003, an 89-year-old California man mistook his gas pedal for the brakes and plowed into a crowded farmer's market, killing 10 injuring 63 others. As for this confused driver, her family says they've now taken away the keys and the car, and they're keeping a close eye on her. Police say the woman is from Wilmington, Delaware. Her daughter found out about it when she recognized the car on the news, and she asked her mom about it. Mom said she had no idea she was going the wrong way, but she had noticed some other accidents on the road around her. Police obviously, George, want her retested before she gets back behind the awesome. wheel, and she'll she had, face charges. She had no idea. No idea. Okay, Jeremy Hubbard, thanks very much. You can weigh in on all this on our shout-out board at abcnews.com.